House Speaker Mike Johnson and Senate Democratic Leader Chuck Schumer have agreed on a funding framework. The president says this is a good first step in the process. Our Washington correspondent Basil John joins us live this morning on reports on the agreement. Good morning, Basil. Well, Jeremiah, good morning. The president also says there is a long way to go as Republicans and Democrats must fulfill their funding responsibilities. Leaders in Congress have come to a deal on top line spending as the government races towards a shutdown. House Speaker Mike Johnson told CBS's Face the Nation he had a top priority. Federal spending must be addressed in a, in a very serious and sober manner. Johnson and Senate Democratic leader Chuck Schumer agreed to a $1.59 trillion deal for the 2024 fiscal year. More than $800 billion for military spending and more than $700 billion for non-defense spending. We have to be good stewards of precious taxpayer resources. Despite the deal, Democrats and Republicans still have an uphill battle ahead on key issues. In a joint statement from Schumer and House Democratic leader Hakeem Jeffries, they said, quote, the framework agreement to proceed will enable the appropriators to address many of the major challenges America faces at home and abroad. Johnson recognized that not all members of his party would be satisfied, as the House Freedom Caucus is sounding the alarm on the deal, calling it a total failure. But on ABC This Week, California Democratic Congresswoman Nancy Pelosi said Congress must avoid a shutdown at all costs. We can't have a government shutdown. Let's be grown up about how we deal with our responsibilities. Now, the House and the Senate have until j the January 19th deadline when the funding runs out for federal agencies. Reporting live in Washington, I'm Basil John. All right, Basil, thank you so much.